Mother's Day is typically a day of celebration where we honor the women who made us who we are. But for some, the day can be filled with sadness. Thanks so much for watching KRK4 News at 10. I'm Jessica Rank. And I'm Caroline Derby filling in for Gary Burton Jr. Latracy Bazell's 15 year old son was shot and killed in October. Today, she says all she wants for Mother's Day is answers. Madison Gaffner joins us live from Little Rock Police Headquarters after speaking with her. Madison, this is her first Mother's Day without her son. It certainly was a day full of emotions and heartbreak. Latracy Bizzle says that she has dreaded this day for months and she hopes that no other parent outlives their own child. I didn't get a um, happy Mother's Day mother um, this morning. A mother grieving the loss of her son, Latracy Bazell missing her son, David Chance Bazell Holmes more than ever. He didn't get a chance to live his life. Um, that, that hurts a lot. Taken at 15 years old due to gun violence, October 14th, 2023. Also impacting another 15 year old victim's life permanently making him a surviving victim. David had just called me about 20 minutes before. A smile turned into tears as her heart was broke after picking up the next phone call she got. I got a phone call and um, said that my baby had been shot and we got there a couple of minutes and I see my son in the car um, and he was already deceased. Not able to reach Davin, she felt helpless. The day he died, I, I, I died too. Every day is another battle as she's still searching for justice. Today being one of the toughest. I'm not the only mother that has this pain and it's excruciating. You know, it's, it's something that you would not wish on anyone in the world. Six arrests have been made in connection. Their 16 year old Charles Gaunt, the third, 19 year old Marquesi Murphy, 22 year old Taekwon Porter Baker, 23 year old Bryant Thompson Jr., and Darius Donahue, and 24 year old Courtney Hood. I'm Madison Gaffner reporting live here from the Little Rock Police Department with KRK4 News. Now back to you, Jessica and Caroline.